Oh, dearie, dearie me. Crazy clown monkey with his chainsaws and shield swords and rocket launchers and everything is currently... Well, he's at it again. And this time around, he's taken on a fabled triceratops. Now, this is actually kind of bad. Come with me, my beautiful little Dilo. We need to get out of the way right this second because if we hang around here any longer... I, look, I don't know if we're going to live to tell the tale. I have no idea who's going to come out of this battle. No, no, please go away, Trudon, or whatever it was. Okay, good. Um... This, this actually is looking pretty good. This actually is looking pretty good. Hold on a second. Can Triceratops finally come? What in the world is that thing over there? That's a big old Megalodon. Uh, no. Okay. Oh, gosh. Uh, I, I don't. Uh, no. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, the cloud dude is still alive. The drag wasn't enough to take it down, which means we got to get our butt out of here. And there is not many places to go right this second, since there is also that giant old primal tech currently. Well, that was an interesting. Yeah, I was going to say that was his like, I'm going to go and yeah, demolish something. Cool. So business as usual in the world of primal fear. Guys, welcome back to another episode. Uh, this has been an insane start. I don't even know. I think this might be the worst start we've ever had to a series. And that is that is saying something we have. We had some pretty horrible starts over the years, and um, today, well, this this so far this week, it's been it's been an interesting one. That is for certain. Now you might be wondering what I'm doing around here. I'm looking for something. Clearly, I'm looking for some backpacks because the old crazy clown monkey dude over there was recently over here. Uh, killing stuff and I wanted to see if any loot was left behind it seems as though though uh, Nothing seems as though there's no little backpacks or anything like that. So that's a little bit disappointing But right now we're kind of a bit of a nomad don't really know what to be doing because uh, we've got the quest to our right We've got the monkey man to our left and we're just kind of floating around in between just trying to survive I'm doing an absolutely terrible job of it so, fingers crossed, today we can turn things around. Guys, if you are enjoying the series, if you do enjoy the video, please help me out by going ahead and punching that thumbs up. And, uh, hey, I got a little announcement to make. You may have noticed over the past few series, we've actually been running our worlds a little differently. I've been running them on servers thanks to the help of G Portal. They've been supporting me and the channel over the last few months. And, uh, hey, if you guys are interested in running your own worlds with my mods and my settings, head on over to gportal.com. I've got a link down in the description where if you use that to purchase your own servers, you'll uh, save 10% on your server costs. And I think I get a little bit of like a refer real bonus myself i don't mind if you use it i don't care if you don't it's there if you want to use it so if you're interested in grabbing your own arc service or service for any pc game in general really in fact i don't even think it has to be pc then head on over to the link in the description um and yeah check it out i'm gonna have it on the screen right now as well just so you guys can see it but like i said no pressure whatsoever it's not really a sponsored thing or anything like that um it's just there if you want a little bit of a 10 percent saving on your service that's all there really is to it. Now, let's keep on going, shall we? I was coming over here to harvest some dinosaurs, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Also, that is an ordinary Quetzal up there. That's that's nice. That's good to see just a regular old Quetzal. I don't know where the tech one went. That's a good thing. I'd rather not know where. I just don't want to I don't want to see it anymore, basically, is kind of the point that I've gotten to here. There is a giant dimorphodon over there. That's, that's a little bit con uh, concerning. Uh, but what I was hoping to do today was tame something. Tame something useful. I mean, look, our dialogue has been pretty sweet. Still has no name, but it's a level 76 dialogue. And I guess putting it toe-to-toe -to -toe with absolutely anything else in this world it's not going to last. It's not going to help us a whole lot. It's not going to really do much for us, unfortunately. Um, I wonder if we should... Hold on a second. Oh, I was going to say, I can hear fight music. Can hear that primal music. Yeah, primal megalodon just cruising around in the water down there. Hold on. Is it fighting something? Hold on. There's a few megalodons down there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Are they fighting each other or are they just... I think they're just splashing their tails around the place. I don't think they'll actually get up to anything. All right, we're just... We're just Forget about them. What is going on over here now? Oh, no. Oh, no. We got monkeys. Oh, there's one right here coming for me. Um, oh, oh, goodness. Oh, go. no. I didn't see the shadow. The shadow was coming straight for me. Um, is my dialogue still alive? Because <laughs> I got a bad feeling. Man, we can't catch a break. This is ridiculous. I, for, for a second there, I thought we might actually be all right, but no, no. And we go, what's with all the giant seagulls out here, dude? This is actual insanity. I, I can't catch. These things are huge. Ah, oh, I'm just going to have to run through them. 
All right, ignore me, giant old itchy thornuses. Please, for once in your life, just pretend I'm not here. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to work out. I really, I really thought if I use my manners and I ask nicely, they might just let me pass. But it wasn't meant to be, I suppose. It wasn't meant to be. That's fine. It is what it is. There's not much we can do about that. But maybe it's about time we... Where do they all go? There's this one. I don't know where the others went. Uh, I gotta go get my stuff at some point. I don't know how I'm gonna get over there. But we do have some stuff here that we can play with now. We've got 42 pieces of metal. It's 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 a little bit of metal. It's, it's not a lot of metal. Um, we also got a lot of blueprints in here. And a lot of ammunition in here. All of which I can't do anything with. Because I don't have the resources to do anything with it. Look at this. 2,856 metal ingots. Craft these up, for example. We got... I'm totally gonna end up dying in my own base, aren't I? I'm going to try my best not to. I do have an idea, though, on what we might be able to do to, I don't know, give ourselves a little bit of a push in the right direction. Like this pump action shot. Oh, I'm nowhere near ready to get the shotgun. There's also a harpoon launcher. Can I get any of these weapons? I'm not close to any of these weapons. This would be sweet. I'd actually be able to knock something out. That'd be fantastic. But basically what I'm thinking we could do is maybe get ourselves the upgrade station. One of my favorite mods. But of course, we're missing a little bit of metal and a little bit of wood. Thankfully, I do have a backup pickaxe. Uh, we can go and quickly try and collect some of this stuff. What I'm thinking is if we can grab some metal, which I have no idea how we're going to grab that. Why is this guy's electric? Are we cool? Okay, good. For a second there, I thought I was just about to die again. Um, if I can do that, I can grab the upgrade station. We can actually break down some of the resources we've got. And maybe if we're lucky, get enough metal to actually craft some stuff up that can keep us alive that tiny, itty little bit longer. It's a long shot, but it's probably the only shot we've got. Or we could just come down this way, down this beach, down there in this direction. I might even just need to like pick up I don't, like just just drop everything and like find somewhere else to live because this beach isn't the safe beach that I thought it was gonna be. It's not the safe space that I was meant to. Uh, it's just it's just not what I need in a little bit of a home with crazed monkeys, sh a shadow nameless. There was there was actually a death worm on this beach yesterday, and of course the giant old tech quetzal. We really don't have much chance of survival out here, do we? Not until we get ourselves hooked up with a good old amount of armor. Um, but we do have this metal now. So hopefully I can grab... I was meant to grab wood as well. Ah, you dummy. Um, all right, real quick. It's not even like I can go and like chop those trees down. Because there's a chainsaw wielding monkey. Hey, monkey man. You want to put those chainsaws to good use? And rather than using them to cut flesh, you want to cut some trees down for me? Because that would be fantastic if you could. This will do. I'll grab another one just in case. True, don't go away. Oh, monkey. Can you just... Uh... All right, fine. If he's going to put him... Oh, 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 there he goes. That's it. Lead him away. Lead him away, little birdie. Like, let him chase you. Chase... No, don't fight back. You got no chance. You can't fight him. Unless you can. Oh, this actually... Okay, I got I to gotta hang around now. What's going on here? <laughs> I don't know where to go. They're both so darn quick. I can't outrun either of them. Not towards me. What are you doing? Um, but you guys feel free to fight each other. Just, okay, leave me out of it, please. That's all I ask. Um, hey, at least they're like down that way and not next to my base for once. Monkey do. Okay, it looks like monkey do was just sitting there chilling. All right. We're back at base at least. We can might be able to actually do this thing. So, upgrade station. Let's grab the resources for it. Monkey dude's coming over there. Oh, please. Just please stay where you are, please. Um, okay, we've got it. I don't really have room to... Oh, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Please. I gotta get out of this base. Because if he gets angry with me in my base, which he is doing... Oh my goodness, he throws... Like... <laughs> oh, no! Ah! Oh, I should have been zigging and zagging, but I just ran in a straight line like a dummy. Uh, well, I can't respawn in my base. So random respawn location it is. And we're right outside our base. Good, I think. I don't know. We'll see what monkey man wants to do. If he wants to leave me alive. Oh, there he is. Okay. We're a little bit further than I thought I was. But uh, yeah, okay. Monkey dude. That's why you don't mess with him. He literally has spears that one shot you. They're on fire and they explode on impact as well. There is literally no way to survive. But hey, we've got our stuff. Some of our stuff. I actually need to get... I don't have... Where are my gravestones? The gravestone mod doesn't seem to be working this series. Which means 
uh, our body over there is decomposing and it we have a limited time to get over there to grab the items off of it what i'm thinking of doing right this second though is breaking down the resources that we do not need so this saddle pelagorna saddle it can go um honestly a lot of this stuff we're not gonna be using it for a while i don't i'm not gonna have a compound bow so let's break it down this pistol i've used up all the ammunition we got for it let's get rid of it and hopefully from this we can grab not bad to be honest oh no monkey go away please please i've had enough of you no oh please don't break my base guys get away from my base please please don't fight in my base no he's literally occupying my base oh he just chopped down my storage he's breaking everything do you know how much do you know how much time and effort I just put into crafting that stuff, dude? No! <laughs> He's just sorted it all up. Are you for real? Oh, come and fight this. Oh, I'm totally gonna die. Don't. No. Fight the Megalodon. Fight the Megalodon. No. Well, we got no more beds to spawn in. I got no more anything. He literally just destroyed everything. How fantastic. How generous. How lovely spectacular somebody's angry with some megalodons um a primal megalodon we really need like a shark nato right this moment if we could get this guy onto land he might actually be able to fix our monkey problem but no he just harvested his buddies he has no care for anything in the world i guess uh well i'm just gonna cruise the shoreline i don't even know what to do right now um this is this is like this is really bad <laughs> there's there's like no ifs or buts about it we might be in the worst position. We, we are in the worst position we've been in this entire series. I've lost everything. I've got nothing but a bunch of backpacks. Oh, and my upgrade station survived somehow. <laughs> All right. How much of this stuff can I actually carry? Because uh, we might not have a choice right now. We can carry all of it. Um, and we got all of this in here. All right. I can actually carry everything. The question is, should we? Like, just because we, we can doesn't necessarily mean we should. But... I guess I'm just gonna... I guess we, we got everything. Let's let's move. We're moving. There's, there's no ifs or buts about it. We just gotta make it happen. Um, Can I grab some foundations? I don't even care. Like, just give me two. And then if I can grab a... Oh, I can't craft a smithy. I need some wood. That's fine. Can I grab a bed? We can grab a bed. Okay, so we can at least set up like a shelter. I'm honestly thinking the beach is not the play here. It hasn't been at all, really. The beach has been nothing but terrible so i'm thinking we move inland i can't believe i'm saying this we're moving off the beach this is not like this is not like any arc i've ever been on before that is a weird looking megalodon down there i think that's a primal i just need to get my items however there is a little old problem called that called that there's that there's that there's that the shadow the shadow nameless no please don't please don't no no i'm gonna die i'm gonna die please don't Please don't. No, 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 no. I need to get my stuff. And now I need to get even more stuff. <sighs> oh, great. Well, we're not going to be surviving out here for long now, are we? Well, at least let me get a punch in. <laughs> Look, it made me feel a little bit better just, just being able to clob it on the head there for a second. So that's, that's good in my eyes, I think. Now, where are we this time? I'm even further. It's sporting me further and further away. But thankfully, we've got a very angry tech parasaur on this beach. So, buddy, can you send me to a spawn point closer to where I want to be, please? This is fast travel in 2023, baby. That's what it's all about. And it's, again, I'm just getting further and further from where I want to be. We may not have a tech parasaur chasing us this time. I do have an alpha dodo, though, like kind of running just back there. Why is there a thorny dragon on this beach? Also, monkey dude is going for that. Oh, I don't even care anymore. I don't even care. I'm going to die in three seconds anyway. What is it? What does it even matter anymore? It just doesn't. <gasps> it died. <laughs> the gorilla's dead. Dude, you saved the day. You beautiful bird. I, I, I just want to thank you. Oh my goodness. You actually did it. You rid the beach of the crazy clown monkey. And as a result, <laughs> look at what we ended up with. Uh, thank you very much for the godliest pike. Also, we got some chainsaws. Unfortunately, I don't have any fuel to 
to fuel them with, but we can get some of that. That's not a worry at all. Um, dude, this actually, things might be looking up. Things might be looking up. I still need to get my stuff. That's going to be problematic, but things are certainly looking up as long as I can see the shadow main from here. It's not a shadow main either. It's a shadow nameless. There he is. He's about to fight that giant fabled Brachiosaurus by the looks of it. There he goes. There is a chance the fabled Brachio might be able to beat him though. I just need to keep... Oh, whoa. <laughs> well, look, I might actually be able to get my stuff up here. That's that's good at least. But um, I just, I don't know what threats lie in that. Oh, you can see his head poking through. Come on, defend yourself, buddy. Did he kill it? Oh, he might have. I think he killed the knight. He killed it. Okay, there is also a giant Kano over here. I just saw it picking its head across. But we're going to try and ignore that. Um, okay, we got our stuff. We're going to get our stuff. Oh, my goodness. And we've got chainsaws. Okay. And I'm really heavy. Oh, no. Because of the chainsaws and stuff. All right. Um, look. I just need to do this. Let me just plop that down. Let me just plop this down. Because I can't do an I, I can't do a thing right now. Let me just chuck everything in there for a second. Oh, that Kano is absolutely going to annihilate everything. All right, let me see. I don't even know what to, I don't even know what to check anymore. I literally am a magnet for dinosaurs of destruction. Oh my goodness. That actually looks like it could have been good. Um, that Kano is nice. No, an Alpha Kano, I'm pretty sure. I need to get that bag and I've got like two minutes to do it. Look, I'm a magnet for crazy dinosaurs. This Megalodon, he's literally eyeing me from the water. You, you can't get me up here, but... You, you don't care. You you would literally beat yourself on land if I'm been getting me. I'm totally about to die, but let me just grab this and we're out of here. <laughs> I can't believe I'm running towards Primal Megalodon. Uh, but you got to do what you got to do. We've got our stuff and that's the main thing. Okay, everything is together at last. There's also the Kano now and he's now guarding my base. If you can even call it a base. So that's not ideal either. You know what would be ideal? If he attacks... The Brachio. The Brachio will absolutely annihilate this Kano. And then we might actually be safe for, to for a total of three minutes today. And that, hey, look, that that's, I, I couldn't ask for anything more than that right now. Brachio, can you and the Kano please fight? Oh, no. Why did an origin, an origin, wait, is it an origin Megalodon maybe? I think it might be. Uh, it doesn't matter. We've made it back to base. Is this a base? I don't even know. But, um... There we go. Okay, we've we've we 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 we're, we're doing. I don't know. I don't know. Are we making progress here? I have no clue. Um, I gotta work out what we're gonna do with all of this stuff though, and how we're gonna move on from here. So, I think I am gonna need some wood. I guess. Dang it. All right, I need a storage box. Unfortunately, yeah, we're moving in land. I don't even care. We're moving up here now. At least we've actually got some tools. I just need to settle down so I can actually, like craft them use them organize them i need i need to get organized that's where we're kind of struggling right now but it's all right let me just grab a box i'm gonna grind some stuff down and we're gonna see what we can do here just iron off this little carno through the menu screen what's like the heaviest stuff we've got here because i know that there is some quite heavy stuff oh it's the shield and the chainsaws sword I've got about the sword extra pike we can break this stuff down we can grind it up in fact this is literally the type of stuff we need to be grinding up as a yes i don't need a shield unless maybe the shield you know what shield could actually keep us alive but also has a lot of metal so i'm gonna grind it up we only need one chainsaw so i'm gonna grind the other the sword can go this pike can go um that's probably about all that can go salvage it all 324 metal lovely Let's grab ourselves a smithy. I'm 15. I need to get crystal. If I can get some crystal, I can get a primal workbench. We might actually be able to get some armor that can keep us alive. That is where the dream lies currently. Um, we're actually not weighing too heavy right now either. So that's also pretty good. Can I break up this scope? Can I break this? Oh, 10 crystal. I need five more. No, <laughs> we're so close. Uh, that's fine. It is what it is. Um, what else could give me crystal? This might primal rocket launcher. No, it's a blueprint. What am I even talking about? Uh, dang it. All right, we, we need another. We need crystal. We need five crystal and we'd be able to actually get us this workbench, but that's not going to happen. Uh, there's also a Kano right here and he's probably going to come over here and kill me in a second. So I need to drop weight like now. Oh, I can't run fast enough. It's fine. Let's use ourselves an experience potion to level up our weight a little bit. Okay, that'll do. That'll do. It's enough to at least get me in land a touch. 
uh which which i'll take oh we got bears out here fantastic okay that bear will maul me if given the opportunity <laughs> it's a nice little nice little spot here ain't it i don't really know what to do with it but it's there all righty just looking for a little like cliff face that i might be able to build on you know what this doesn't look like the worst spot in the world right this second. Also, I'm just assuming my Dilo died, right? I completely forgot about our little old Dilo. I have no idea if my Dilo is still alive, but I think the odds of it surviving all of that chaos, the shadow thing in my bobby, yeah, I, I, I just don't think, it's po I don't think it's possible. So we're gonna set up shop right here, I think. Let's grab some wood. Let's grab some thatch. I kind of like the tree there. I don't want to get rid of that, but too late. It's fallen. Um, let's grab a little bit of fiber. And then let's get some foundations crafted. Should we just jump straight to stone? Wow, I, I, I got a lot of... Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's just grab stone. No, no, there's no reason not. There's no reason. In fact, in fact, we'll just craft all the stone foundations we possibly can. I think that's probably the best bet here. All right, that will do. A little three by two with a little one on the side um can i get do i have okay we can get a bed nice i'm just a little bit of wood short of a second one the second one is ideal for respawning that's why we always get two so we can just fast respawn whenever we whenever we die once we generally die a second time that's why we need two of them on top of that we could probably grab ourselves a storage box now as well did i not double click you there you go we can grab us a box another box that is um, there's a smithy down there by the water, by the, by the, but I, don't, I have to go and collect it. It's down, it's down by the, it's down there on my, my other little platform. Uh, the unsafe one that has a carno living beside it, but that's okay. Um, let me go and place my box over here. Let me go and place my little beds in this little spot over here. Bam, bam. I'm going to just admire the view for a second because we've actually got a second to breathe. And then let me go and, uh, uh do we just... You know what? Just do this. Just just dump it all across. There we go. All right. Let me go and grab the remainder of my stuff from down here. Mm, you're going to be chill? I think he's going to give me... I think he's going to be chill. Let's just go. Okay. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Oh, it won't let me pick it up. That's a shame, but that's fine. No, that's not fine. I need to craft another one then. I can pick you up. I can pick... I can't pick items up. Oh, what? I can pick my bed up, but I can't pick my smithy up? Okay, that is interesting. Never mind then. I guess we'll have to craft a freshie. That's fine. I don't care right now. It's all good. Things are finally looking up. I don't know if I don't know if they're looking up. All I know is I'm looking up because I gotta run up this hill. I don't think that's what they mean when they say looking up, but yeah. And of course we're here just in time to be thirsty. We're the furthest from water we've ever been, and we're thirsty. That is ironic. That's what that is. Alright. <laughs> safe at last if you can even call it that i don't know if you can call it that but we're, we're here now i guess we gotta work out a plan on what to actually do from here um we I, I i need i need another smithy that's what we need can i grab that we can it's not gonna get us any closer to crafting anything that we need unless i have enough metal which i should have enough metal actually to get us I should be able to get a, a rifle. Can I get a rifle? <gasps> okay, long neck rifle. Fantastic. Before we even manage to get a crossbow. On top of that, we can also get some flak. We can't get flak armor yet? Oh, I'm only level 52. What level is you need to get flak armor? Oakley dokley, 56. Uh, we could get a lot of this other armor though. But I don't. Actually, actually, what do you need for alpha? Alpha blood, alpha hide. And metal ingots. Unfortunately, you also need the workbench, the primal one. I don't have a primal workbench, so we can't do that. We do, though, have this rifle, which I'm assuming is going to allow us not to shoot those, but it will allow us to shoot these, which means we should be able to actually deal some torpor to some dinosaurs now. That That is great. We've also got these fellas here. I don't think I can craft any on my body, so we really do need that workbench, this one. And I'm five crystal short still. Unless, yeah, no, there's no, I have nothing else I can break down, unfortunately. What did get destroyed in all the chaos, though, was our forge. So I think we're going to have to grab one of those right this second. I've got some oil. I'm going to try and turn that into some fuel. Because if we can get our hands on a chainsaw, like, resource problems will be just 
a thing of the past and it'll be fantastic all right forge is on the way and unfortunately so is our like starvation level so well thirst levels at least now can i get some fuel we can yes i just need some wood so we'll go and grab just a few pieces of wood chuck them in here crop this stuff for europe and then we'll we will have chainsaw access i guess the next step after that might actually be taking down that Kano. I just don't know how much health that's got. But hey, we do have crystal now, which means actually, how did I forget this? We can get ourselves a spyglass. How did I not even think of that? On top of that, we probably got enough for a water jar as well. Yes. Okay, this is good. All right, we can grab water while we're down there, which we shouldn't have to return too soon. So that's that's just delightful. Um, I'll check you over here. Okay. Let's have a look, eh? So this is uh, this is what we're kind of dealing with currently. We've got an Alpha Kano with 21,000 health. Can't tame it. It needs Alpha Kibble. We've got a Fabled Brachio with 400,000 health. <laughs> We've got a Diabird down here that I can't do it. I might be able to tame that actually. Oh, this is actually what do you need to what do you need to eat? It's just a regular Diabird. They eat prime meat and they eat mutton or they eat anything. They eat anything really. And I do have a tame member. I could totally tame this thing. Could a Diab? Hello? There is an alpha die bear up here with us. What? Um, I no longer feel safe anymore. <laughs> I no longer feel safe at all. Uh, that's not good uh, at all. What would happen if I were to shoot it with a dart? Would that be a bad idea, do you think? Should I shoot it with a dart just to see what happens? Or should I just... Why? No! Get out of my face! I'm going to shoot it with an arrow. That was not a good arrow. Let's try that again, hey? Oh, that didn't reach. This is going to end so badly. Got him. Okay. I don't know why I did that. I think the idea was to like lead it off the cliff, but there's not a cliff here, which means I'm in trouble. <laughs> I'm in so much trouble right now. Where did he go? Oh, well, we knew that was coming sooner or later, didn't we? It's only a matter of time before I passed out from thirst and, um, well... Thankfully, we were far enough away from the Alpha Die Bear. I'm hoping he's forgiven us, but that's not going to last for long. Let's be let's be honest with ourselves here. That uh, it's going to be a short-lived experience. Maybe we just, you know, call it what it is. Call today a very, very weird and it's a bit of a. Oh, hello. You know what? Let me do this one more time. Jump off the cliff. Run off the cliff. Run off the cliff. Run off the cliff and let me run back up the cliff. No, he didn't run off the cliff. No, he didn't run. Oh, he's going to demolish my base. Oh, he's going to demolish my base. Did he demolish my base? Tune in tomorrow to find out.